gonna actually capture this. But, um... Anyway, fucking... So I, I really wanted to make this dual touch with my friend. And so we started trying to get clips, and I was getting some clips, and... He was working on it. He wasn't really getting that many, but, uh... You know, I had... I had faith. Let's just... I had... Let's just say that. Um, but... He ended up... He ended up backing out, and he was like, I just can't get clips, and just not good enough. And I was like, you know what, you fucking bitch. So I just, you know, I moved on. I basically said, whatever, I'll just make one, one by myself. And, um, I was, I was getting the clip, so I was like, alright, I can, I've got the gameplay, but I really want good editing. I really want, like, I want, like, decent editing. So I, you know, started looking into various editing programs and, like, what people were using, etc. <sighs> And I remember it's my first, like, you know, because I knew how to use Windows Movie Maker. Um, so, my first, like, step up from that was this editing program called uh, Cyberlink Power Director, like, Pro 9 or some shit like that. And it was, like, pretty much shit. I mean, it was, like, barely a step up from Windows Movie Maker. It was probably, like, iMovie. It was essentially iMovie, that's what it was. Wow. Um, but anyway, I. I moved on to that, and I remember I made my like first Halo montage with this gay Mo Moby song. It was pretty retarded, and I thought it was so cool. But um, yeah, it really wasn't that great. Um, oh, you fucking. But anyway. So anyway, guys. I did with that, and then I was like, fuck, I'm not really going to get much shit done with this. So I moved on to, finally, I downloaded uh, Sony Vegas Pro Pro 8, I believe it was, and uh, started trying to learn that. And that was like my first real challenge, because, you know, that's a non-linear linear editing program, and I just, I wasn't used to it. Uh, it, was just, it was a different style, it's not, you know, you have multiple layers, and you can do so many different things, like, for so many different options, I wasn't used to that. So that was maybe a little bit discouraging at the time, but eventually, after just many tutorials and well, many tutorials and different things, I got I got pretty damn good at it. Um, hello. I'm chasing this fucker. Oh wow! <laughs> Didn't know he had that. But um, so I got pretty good at that, and I started uh, you know. Bjorn had like some practice editing clips out and I was uh, working on, I edited a couple videos with those and tried to like, you know, get some of my stuff out there, which that never really happened. I still don't, you know, I have 73 subscribers now, obviously my name really isn't out there that much, but, you know, I, so I moved on from there. And <clears throat> um, eventually I learned Adobe After Effects to a degree, and um, finally, I landed a, a project doing a dual touch for a couple of, I, you know, they weren't really, like, semi-pros or anything, but they had been to a couple MLG events, and I was doing a couple, some projects for them, or, yeah, for them, I did a trailer and a montage for them, I actually ended up, uh, tri with them, and, uh, which is nice, because I finally got to show off a couple of my clips, which had uh, gotten considerably better since my first attempt at a at a Halo video, and so I, uh, so we I released, we released Remembered Halo 3 montage, and had a really good, I really liked it, got really good reviews everywhere it was, I mean, it was kind of just like simple editing, I didn't try to overdo it, per se, uh, should have got a double right there. Adobe After Effects, and just, I guess, it's really, really gotten, uh, from there, I decided I really wanted to do editing and film, because, I mean, um, just learning through, like, capturing gameplay, and, uh, learning what angles look good, and how editing, like, what edits work, what edits don't, um, has, you know, really, I was like, wow, I kind of have a knack for this type of thing, and, um, I mean, granted, I'm nowhere near as, you know, I'm not as great as, I'm not saying I'm that great, but I have, I'm, I'm a lot better than anybody, like, at my school or any, you know, 
any, anywhere like that. And, um, so I really wanted to do editing now, and, uh, but I, the thing was I hadn't really done any, like, film or anything, you know, any, uh, videos like that, but eventually, you know, word got around in school that I was a pretty good editor, so, uh, I ended up doing a lot of, uh, school videos for people's, like, class projects and stuff, like some comedy sketches that people did for certain projects, and that was actually, um, really nice it got me you know got me working with my first cam like my i got my first camera because of it and started to just to get wow i got a hair strike that's a that's a first okay where am i going to put it now that's probably a shitty area but But, um, anyway, wow, this is like a 20 minute video now. So, yeah, school projects and kept working and, uh, doing that and I got better and better and now I'm, I've got a Canon 7D, which is one of the, uh, probably like the, the Canon 7D and the Canon 5D are like the high end video, the high end cameras that are being used on YouTube right now. Like all the, uh, major YouTubers are. Uh, using them to produce videos and uh, it's really it's it's very high quality video coming from a from a uh, Canon DSLR and uh, I've got now I've got this shotgun mic for it and I've got a couple lenses and I've you know I've worked some paid jobs now for doing some editing and film and I've recently applied to college for film because that you know that's what I want to do now and uh, it's looking pretty good I'm pretty happy where I am right now and uh, I figure I'm going to try and use my uh, YouTube channels as like a starting point for me, you know. It's just, um, it's a good place to get our video, get my videos out. And I have a friend, Zach, when I say R, um, my friend Zach, he uh, helped me with uh, doing my film portfolio and he's, we love working together on different film stuff and, you know, he's a big gamer too. I mean, he's not as competitive, but he plays a lot, uh, he plays a larger variety of games, I should say, and he's probably probably going to dual commentary with me on a couple of vid videos um, coming up, so you guys should probably hear from him. Um, so yeah, we're gonna he's going to help probably join me on my channel, um, and we're going to do try and come up with some sort of series of videos that we can kind of monopolize, because uh, as of now, you know, YouTube kind of, a lot of people are hitting all the... Uh, the genres on YouTube, you know, there's so many comedy uh, channels out there. I'm not really a big comedy guy. I don't really. I mean, well, I'm more like satirical. I guess I make fun of shit, or I like. I don't try to be funny. I guess I should say. Um, like I don't make sketches to be funny. I don't really find that fun. I'd rather make a meaningful video with a lesson or a, a like a twist, or you know something like that, than a sketch sketch comedy video. Um, so we're probably going to be trying to do something like that, you know, some, probably a lot of, s some action videos, because, you know, I've got so many kids around, like, all willing to act for me and stuff, that'd be nice, so, I mean, that's basically it, I mean, I'm, as I said, I'm Taylor, I'm, I'm 17, yeah, sem <laughs> I know, well, yeah, I was just making sure I hadn't said that before, I am 17, and, um, male, um, you know, single, no, I'm just kidding, <laughs> I'm not going to advertise my, myself on the, on the internet, except I'm, I'm not single, guys, you know, I'm not, not a big nerd, just letting you know, but anyway, um, I guess that's it, um, if you guys have any, like, special questions or anything, uh, referring to any of my videos or, just you know, I want to say hi or anything. Feel free to inbox me or hit me up on AIM. I'll you know I'll I'll post the in the comment or in the uh, description my AIM and it's all that stuff and different things like that. So all right, uh, I kind of want to just keep her. Well, I like, should have died right there. Okay, I'm dead. Yep. Okay, good good spot to end it. Alright, thanks guys. Peace.